This show is brought to you by. This show is brought to you by Benjamin, Dharma Wheelies, Milk Bucks, It's Leon Motherfucker, Parkman, Phone Losers of America, Fancy Pants, MST3 Clay, Anonymous, Gordo, Crispy808, and Mr. Turbois. Thank you to everyone for supporting the show. You can find out more about the show at immoralhole.com. You can find our show archives at travelswithmiriam.com. You can help contribute to the show by visiting immoralhole.com forward slash show forward slash contribute. Thank you for calling Huntsville and Double Train and Sweet Huntsville South. This is Eric coming to Ricky Call. Hi, we have a squirrel problem. Hello? Say that one more time? Yes. Yeah. I, I was outside earlier and I saw a squirrel. I asked him how he spends his days. And he said, we uh-huh. play and run in many ways, and when uh-huh. the winter comes and it's cold, we cuddle up and we're never bold. Do you know what he's talking uh-huh. about? No, I don't. Well, yeah, the squirrel had a fluffy tail. Mm-hmm. And he said, it's just, it, that's just how it is. It's it's puffy. Yeah. And my brother's here. He was driving the car at the time. Here, brother, take the phone. I gotta take care of my pants. Thank you. Thank you for double training, sweet Huntsville South. This is Eric. Yeah, my brother just handed me the phone and you hung up. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, good. Yeah, my brother, we're talking about a goddamn squirrel problem we have in the uh-huh. room. Uh huh. You see, the squirrel's in the wall. Two six, and then the squirrel came out of the wall. It came out of the wall. And what room are you in? Well, this squirrel seems to have some sort of intelligence because it can take off the electrical outlet like a little door. It takes it Mm -hmm. off and puts it back on and hides in there. Oh wow! What's the room number? Two six sixteen, and then. We tried saying, hey, get out of here, squirrel, and he had a little hat and a jacket. Mm-hmm. Ow, he bit me! He kept saying his name is Secret Squirrel. Mm-hmm. And you said, what's the wrong number? And then we, we, Secret Squirrel, his name is Secret Squirrel. Secret Squirrel? Wow. Yeah, he opened his jacket and said, look at these nuts. <laughs> oh wow! I'm sorry, but what's that room number again? Two sixteen. Two sixteen. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, baby. Okay. So, well, um, so me and my brother, we we're wondering, we we're wondering if you could come over here and help us rearrange these nuts. Sure. <laughs> All righty then. God damn it. Best damn service in town. All right. <laughs> I'll see you in a minute, baby. All right. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Hi. I was outside. Uh, I-, I made a talking squirrel out there. Is that normal? <laughs> no, it's not. 
That's well, he was very fine. surprised and curious, and I asked him some questions, and he answered back with clarity. Well, he told me about how he spends his days playing and running, and how he stores nuts for the winter. It was a really oh, unique my. encounter out there. <laughs> Was yeah. there anything I could help you with? Yeah, how do I get in contact with the squirrel? Because I, I just got back from the <laughs> clinic and I, I tested positive. <laughs> um, I'm not sure, but I'll leave him a note outside if you'd like. <laughs> All right, that sounds good, honey baby. All right, you have a good evening. You too, dear. Love that squirrel. <laughs> Sleeping sweet well, in your... Hey, uh, goddammit, there's a squirrel in the room. Good evening, thank you for calling the West, and this is Angel. How can I assist you this evening? There's a squirrel in the goddamn room. It's a who? There's a Hello? squirrel in the in the room. Hello? Yes, let me let me call engineering. Engineering for a goddamn squirrel? Who else I'm going to send up there to get the squirrel out the room? Why don't you come up? What are you doing? I'm the operator. I'm in back of the house. I can't come up to your room and get a squirrel out of there. Well, the squirrel's cool. I just wanted to tell you that there's a squirrel here. I don't know if you know that. No, we don't know that, and I don't want the squirrel to be in the room with you guys. Yeah, the squirrel's fine with me. Hey, guys, you guys think the squirrel's cool? <laughs> Yeah, he's touching me. He's he's licking my sack. Huh? The the squirrel the squirrel loves nuts. I just tell you that he loves nuts. Oh my god! I don't think it's safe for you guys to this, stand with a squirrel in there. It the squirrel has a little bushy tail and a and a, a white t shirt on. <laughs> Hello, are you guys pulling my leg tonight? It's it's weird because we we poured water on this on the squirrel's shirt and we seen her little you know squirrel. <laughs> Excuse me. Nothing. And then out of nowhere, I did. She did. She just bent over and lifted her tail. God damn, mm-hmm. that squirrel's hot. Excuse me. Chestnuts. Thank you for calling the Holiday Inn at the Birmingham Airport. My name is Caitlin. How can I help you? Hi, Caitlin. Hey, Caitlin. There's a squirrel in the room with me and my brothers here. He's been talking to us through the vents and he popped out his head. Can I help you? Hi, yeah. I'm eating uh, plant byproducts in my room and a little squirrel rushed out when I turned the air conditioner on. A squirrel? Yeah. He poked his little head out, and he's like, cha- he's going all around the room. He's, I've been trying to catch him with my hat, but he, my brother's here. My two brothers are here. What room are you in? Oh, here, let me give the phone to my brother. I gotta try and chase this little bastard. Hey, ma'am. What room are you in? Ma'am, uh, well, I'm in the yeah, bathroom right now. My, bu- my brother. Yeah, okay. my brother's uh, chasing him around the bedroom. This is a prank call. Uh, Two ten. We're in two ten, lady. We're in two ten. We're in two ten, lady. Last but follow my lead. I got an idea. Thank you for calling the Ocean Hotel. This is Carrie. Hey. Hello. Hi. Are you guys Are you guys aware there's a cat? Hello. Hello. Yes, I said hello. I cannot understand what you're what you're speaking of. I I said, are you aware there's a cat? A cat where? Well, it was outside, and now I try and do that again. Eugene, can I help you? Hey, ah, uh, hello. Yes, can I help you? There's a cat. Yeah. A cat came in the room. What number are you in? 216. Do you know there's cats here? 216? There's cats. Do you know there's cats? No, I don't know. 
The cat is right here. Here, I'm going to put the cat on the phone. What is this? Are, are you going to talk to the cat lady? Do you want to get what? Hello? 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 Yes, can I help Hello? you? Hello? My brother's right here and he said he found a cat. What do you mean your brother's right here? This is a motel, sir. Yeah. He's right here. Talk to my brother. Get on the phone, bro. Bro. That called in. Hello? Hello. Hi. Hi. I'm looking to... Hi. I'm, I'm just... I want to let you know there's a cat wandering around the property, and there was a squirrel, and they were, the squirrel was riding on the cat. I don't know if that's, <laughs> like, one of your pets there, or... There's a squirrel... There's a cat? There's a cat, but there was a squirrel riding the riding the cat. I've never seen that before. I'm just, is this for real? Is this a real call? This is for real, yeah. I thought it was you maybe one of your trained animals. <laughs> no, there's a, there's a cat running around the property with a squirrel on its back. Yeah, it looked like they were, they were like committing like fraud like, outside. Is it fighting? Like they were Are they okay? trying to get people? <laughs> like giving food and nuts? Uh, all right, well... Well, we'll we'll go check it out. Where who are you staying here? No, no, I'm a local. Well, I was walking oh, okay. by. Yeah. Oh, and you were just walking by and you yeah, saw I've a never cat seen that a... before. I thought maybe it was one of your pets and you had a pet squirrel and they were they were married or something. Uh -uh. No. No. Well thanks all for right. letting us know. Yeah, all right then. All right, good night. Good night. Oh, Hello? Hi, yeah. We're outside and there's there's a cat riding a squirrel. They came out of a room together. Yeah, Hi, yeah, there, there's a squirrel out here. He's taking all my walnuts. What am I supposed to do? Mm, not for sure on that one. <laughs> I mean, he he came out of a room. He was riding a kitty cat. Is that one of the pets here? Or? Mm, not that I know of. Well, that's weird. Is there a circus in town? Nope, not that I know of. All right, let me let me pull my brother around because it's mighty weird, you know. Okay. All right. Hello, Inner Hello. 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 Hi. Yeah, hi. I'm here hi. with my family. We're in the station wagon, and we just need to know if you if I have any uh, room vacancies. What type of room are you looking for? Well, there's uh, there's Can eight of us. Yet? There's eight. Um, yeah. Okay, so the rooms I have right now are double non-smoking. So they're just two beds in the room. Okay, so eight and two beds. So four people per room? Um, yeah, if that's if that's how you want to do it. Oh, I want to do mm. it, yeah. Me too. You want, you want the two rooms? Oh, yeah. Okay, can I get uh, your Ask her if we can bring balloons. Well, you, you can talk, oh, brother. Gonna... Here, i got to take the wheel. Baby, is that you on the phone? Can we bring some balloons with us? Ooh, I'm going to build my own breakfast. I built it, I'm here, director, call. Just want to build my own guy. Hello? Breakfast. Can you hear me, sir? Yes, thank you for calling the true. How may I help you? Okay. Uh, now, we got a little bit of an issue here in the room now. Um, I was trying to get the dang uh, AC uh, cranked up. And uh, I hit it on the side, and a dang old lizard crawled out the side of her. Oop, all right. What room are you in? Goddamn. Well, uh, uh, it, uh, it, uh, the 210, but it, I think it's a salamander or a gecko or something like that. I'm a bitch. 
That motherfucker yeah, really. climbing up them walls like it's nothing. You're in two ten, and there's a a lizard crawling up your room. I got yeah, it's a goddamn salamander, or gecko, or uh, a guan or something like that. Could even that be one of them beardy dragons for all I know. That thing's definitely slimy, Jonathan. That thing is dangerous. I've seen that tail fall off. Broke back in two minutes. Okay, uh, I will send someone up for you. Well now, well now, I don't know where it went. It then crawled into the uh, drawer or something. That's a goddamn lizard foot. Uh, well, Sir, I thought I was supposed to be tagging up. people in. Why are they just talking? Shut your fucking bitch ass up, motherfucker. Kick your fucking ass. Sir, is there no control over these dummies? Hello? Hi. Hi, lady. Hi. Hello? Hi, yeah. I'm in the room and the squirrel, he came in and he said hello to me and he said, Hi. Hi. How are you doing? To whom you want to speak? Hello? Hello? Yes? Hi. Yes, how can I help you? I don't know. Hold on. I gotta, I gotta, uh, I have to push a button. Hold on. Could you see it? Sound effects. Hello? Hello? Oh! Could you see in? Can you hear me? Yeah, hi. I am the motherfucker driving to the hotel. How are you? I'm doing fine. I have no rooms available tonight. No, you have no room. No, I have a room. I have a room. You do? Okay. What's the name on that? I do. My name is Dwight, and I'm the criminal in 215. Oh, okay. I have 30, I have 35 scans of marshmallow. Oh, shit! Oh, God, fuck it! Oh, God. Oh, God, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Ah! Are you all right? Ah! 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 Are you all right? Hi, uh, I'm sorry. I rear-ended a Tesla and I made a hell of a racket while on the phone. Oh, not a problem, not a problem. But I did take out three quarters of the back of the hotel. Well, they'll just have to deal with it, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. All right, see you in a few, honey. Uh Uh-huh, bye-bye. And you said you're in which room? 215. 215, okay. All right, bye-bye, big titties. Thank you for coming right away. You're heading home. Hey, oh. can you hear me? Oh, yeah. I can moan out I want to. You hear me all right? Mm-hmm. Oh, good, because mm-hmm. I want you to hear this clearly mm-hmm. when I say, fuck you. Mm-hmm. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, okay. Oh fuck yeah! I need a I need a room now. Now I need a room. Shit. Oaxaca is cheese. Hotel Six, Steve, I can help you. Hey, uh, me and my brothers are right here. Do you guys have Oaxaca cheese? Some what? Oaxaca cheese. Oaxaca cheese. Oaxaca cheese. I have no idea what you're trying to say, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oaxaca cheese. Here, talk to my bro. Okay. Hey. Hey, sorry. I can't uh, understand what he's saying. What's yeah, bro. We need to not cheese, dude. because he's Hispanic? Are you a racist? No, uh-uh. Okay, but well, how do you not understand him? He speaks the niche. He speaks the English. Hey, he said we don't have that kind of cheese. What does that mean? 
I have no idea, man. I think Hello? he's talking about Schmegma. Hello? My yeah. name is Pico. Hello? Microtel in and sweet, how may I help you? Microtel? I couldn't find you. Where are you at right now? Uh, well, there's a cat out here and there's a squirrel riding it. I'm not sure if that's like one of the pets here. So I'm a little concerned, like, are the pets here, like, taking drugs or something? Hello? Hello? Hi. Yeah, so I'm, I'm out here, and I saw a cat that's walking around the property, but there was, like, a squirrel on it. Is oh, that really? one of your pets? Yeah. No. Okay, so that that makes me a little skeeved out, because if the, the animals are acting weird, then I don't know if... You know, what's going on here? Yeah, yeah. I don't control the yeah. animals, so... You have a good night. Well, I'm coming in. I'm coming in. I'm sorry. Oh. Hello? Hello? Gordon in. This is Paola. How may I help you? I want to touch... Hello? No. Oh. Can we just bring balloons in the in the room? Hello? Hello? The what? Can we you bring balloons in the room? Hello? Yeah. Can you hear me? Balloon. Yeah, hi. Ba- it's Black History Month and I demand a discount. Steve Ray, can I help you? Hi, Sweet Lips. How hey. are you doing? It's Steve Ray, can I help you? Uh, let me put my brother on. My phone's uh, battery is dying, but he, here, he has the call too. Here, take it, honey. Hello? 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 Hey, What's the I'm hole in the side of the hotel policy? The what? I want to drive my car through the hotel into my room because my car is very expensive. I want to keep it safe. Right away. Christine, how can I help? Hey, you yeah, have I one don't... goddamn job. Yeah. Hello. Hey. Evan, give me, Evan, Evan, give me the Hello? phone. Hey, well, you had one okay. job, one goddamn job, and you failed at it miserably, like a son of a bitch. Evan, give me the phone. You're not. You're. You're too drunk to drive, sir. Uh, I'm sorry, ma'am. This guy, I let him drive my Uber, and uh, he, he's hes really, he's wasted. What he's room drunk, number are you and, calling from, and uh, who who are I, you calling? I don't know. This guy's driving. He's fucking mad. He's nuts. Yeah, he's we're in an Uber. Back. We're in an Uber. We're trying to find a hotel, and the driver's yelling at us. He said he was going back to his hotel room. And that didn't make any sense to any of us. Okay, so what address you guys are trying to reach to and, like, what's the issue? Why you are calling to the hotel? I saw on his phone that he was calling you, so I called you, and it, uh, I'm... Uh, Shut up. I'm getting, we're, I'm we're, getting out of the car. Drive your... No. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's fine. ma'am. Yeah. No, we're headed to you. We're headed ma'am. to you. Ma'am. I forget what the address... Oh, God damn it. The driver just got out of the car. He just His left door us. door is wide open. Yeah, we're all just, in the back. Just... We don't know what to go... God, hey, I'm, I'm, just a, I'm just a tech bro in the back of the Uber. I don't know anything. Uh, okay, so, so can y'all hear me? Yes. Am I quiet? No, no, we can not hear you. Let's go down to town. Oh, wait. Thank you for calling the Holiday in downtown Tulsa. This is Brandy. How may I help you? I don't know. How can you? Hey, what's up? Uh, hello. How may I help you, sir? Hey. I don't know. This place is trash. I, I don't know. I was thinking about 
staying here. And then I was like, well, you know, there are lots of places to stay. And then they say, oh, you know, thank you for choosing us. We know you have a lot of choices when it comes to lodging. And then I was like, oh, yeah, cool. You know, I'll stay here. And then I get in my room and there's no chocolate on the pillow. There's no mints or anything special. Oh no, nothing in the bathroom. 215. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, we don't um, actually have things like that here at the Holiday Inn. You would have to go somewhere a little bit more luxurious. <laughs> oh, do you, you mean this isn't the lap of luxury? I, this is as far as my dollar goes, though. Yeah. Uh, well, you, you, well, you could do something well, for me, like maybe wait. send a minstrel to the room to start singing or something. Uh, no, sir, I'm sorry, but is there anything else I could try to help you with? <laughs> do you have any, like, leftover Valentine's chocolates that you could bring to my room? Make me feel special? No, no sir. If there's nothing else I can do God, for you, it. I have a line here. Have a good night. Oh, don't, don't worry about them. They're... <clears throat> Thank you for calling the Courtyard by Marriott Souls downtown. This is Courtney. How can I help you? Oh. Hi. Hello, this is Courtney. the Courtyard. Courtney, do you, do you have a throat available? Do I have a what? A throat. A scoop? Yeah. Um, Hello. For what? Yeah. Oh, hi. Sorry, my brother's telephone is sounding horrible. Um, I've got him on a conference call here. Uh, we need a scoop. Or do you feel like ice? Uh, we got a bathroom situation uh, here. Oh, I'm sorry. What is the room number? It's two one. What is the room number? What is the room number? No, uh, when I, uh, hold on. What I think, what, what I think God is trying to say is Excuse he's trying me. to ask what you. What is the room number? Yeah. It's 215. We yeah, do not have 215. Yeah, whatever. Give me a scoop. God we're, damn it. We're, 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 ah! Front desk. Yeah, Front how you desk? doing? I got, yeah, how you doing? Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm I'm in a room and uh, I, I'm wondering like. Are you? What? Okay, oh, so say, say that again. I How are you? Can... Sir, you're loud. Something's loud. I, I need Are room. You? My name. Why How are you? you? Why are you so loud? Okay, Hello? so sir. Sir, I, I found this computer in the lobby, Hello? and I was wondering if you knew what the password was. Like, it, c- c- Hello? I... Hello? Duh, duh, duh. Hello? 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 Hello. Hello. I need yeah, a room, no. Marachod. Yeah, Marachod, I need a room. We don't have a room. So loud. Do you have sister, Marachod? Ben Kelora, Makalora. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, he hung up harder. I need this accent. Jim Martin. Hmm? Hello? Hey, termite? 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 Termite in? Yeah, yeah yes. there are termites in my room. Yeah. I'm in termite? room 215. Yeah, I can hear them crunching on the walls. It's a really, Did like, they... soft crunching. We don't have a room 215. Do you mean 115? Uh... Yeah, I'm, I'm, it's kind of smeared on my key card, on the jacket of my key card. Maybe, yeah, you're right. One fifteen. We don't have key cards. Jeez, I'm just batting a hundred. <laughs> so yeah, what are you going to do about the hungry termites in my room? 
far as we know, we don't have termites. We just got treated less than a year ago. Oh, is that why your place looked like a big circus with the tents on top and stuff? Yeah, tell her, tell her that my wooden leg says otherwise. God damn it, I'm half a leg down. Um, actually, ma'am, ma'am, this is this is John. It's a prank call, and uh, I was I I was told by my brother Evan to tell you that you probably now have crab loss. Get checked. Okay. It's crabs. Yeah, she has checked. She, yeah, she, okay, she, I don't she, really uh, appreciate. Yeah, I, no, yeah. Uh, yeah, ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Ma 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 uh, I, I was told to call you to tell you that you may have crap louse. I'm doing this as a favor. Go to the okay, doctor well, I don't because really you may have an STD. I appreciate the prank call, and if it happens again, I will it's report the number to you. Oh, no. Not, it's not a prank call. You probably Jeez. have an STD now because you fucked my brother. Okay. You have the it, wrong it, number. The wrong? If you call back again, I will call the police no. and report your number. Ma'am, it's not the wrong number. I was told to call you to warn you about the fact that you might have a fucking STD. I'm doing you a favor. Sir, you just called an underaged minor? If you call again, I will report your number to the police. Goodbye. Well, 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 I don't... That's why. Thank you for calling the Keaton Sweets of Catacoma. How can I help you? Hi, I just want to let you know I released termites into the room. They're your problem now. What was that? There's too, there's too much goddamn wood in this room. Like, what, what did you guys do? Make everything out of wood in my room? What room are you in? I'm in 215. Like, the, the stand, the table, the chair, everything wood in here. So, to take care of the wood situation, I release termites. Okay. And right now, they're busy at work. I'm just letting you know, termites are your problem now. Now, now problem yours. Okay. So, so what, do you, what do you think about that? Smart guy, I bet you went to high school, didn't you? I bet you got an education, didn't you? You got a degree. The new, new shuffle. And just to Hello? Wonder, how can I you? Hi, I need to know if I can do the new new shuffle when I get there in the room, because I'm here with uh, bed bug bed bug Sally, and we're, we're decorating the room with bed bugs. Which room number are you in? Uh, two one five. We want to do the new new shuffle, where we shake our gond and lund together. No, which room you are in? Two one five. We don't have two one five, brother. What? What is you? You listen, Bancho. Yes, you do. I'm in two fifteen. Brother, don't talk we don't like have two hundred and fifteen room number. I'm telling you. You're talking like nonsense, like Chutiatsala Gandu. Nothing is wrong with the number. The number is correct. Can you bring your receipt and come to the office? I can bring your mother and your sister. So they I have can bring everyone. This, his stupid language is using bad language. Hello? Hello? Hi, my name is Haram Yeah, my name is Haram Charikuta. I'm in room oh. 215. 215, sir, we don't have a 215 room number, sir. Yes, you do. You don't know anything about the place that you work. Sir, this is the interstate motel. This is the interstate motel. We don't yeah. have a room. Yeah, we don't have a room 215. We don't have a room Look, number 215. We have a only 100 I number. No, the room number. No, no. No. No room number? The, the number is... No. Look, I'm looking at the card right now. It says 215... And the person who signed me in was is called Londele Maru. Is that you? No. No, sir. Maybe you have Your name is not Lund? No. Huh. Yeah, that's why we said and no, sir. Name... That's why I said we don't have a room number 215 also. But what was he talking about? I was using bad language. Who? 
Oh no 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 he the he, he thought no no I I understand sir I understand no but he thought you when you give it to name that's why he say something you use the word no 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 you are okay sir you just give it oh. to name the person name yeah 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 no no and yeah, he don't have a no sir yeah, and we don't have a room number two one five yeah. Yeah, he said I was a GB Road Rundy, and then he handed no, no, you the. No, sir. Oh no, no, we don't have no? anybody person name, okay? Huh. Ma'am, 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 we're at one fifth. We're in one fifteen, you stupid monkey. Oh, we are. Oh shit. Yeah, we're in one fifteen. I'm sorry. One fifty, one, 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 one five. Yeah. No, one one five. We don't have it, sir. One one five. I'm in here. I'm making. One, that's why I'm asking you. I don't know, sir. Maybe you have a wrong number. Maybe. Okay. Maybe you have a wrong number. Maybe I'm a. Maybe I'm a, a, maybe I'm a, a unicorn. Hey, how can I help you? Hell hey, yeah. I've got four wheel drive. What's that mouth do? Sorry. <laughs> I have yeah. four wheel drive. How's your mouth? Yeah, ma'am. I, I'm sorry for my brother. I, I'm driving the stern whipper this guy. No, he's got he's got the gas pedal. He, it's not out of control. No, but I'll go, yeah, wait, no, shut up, idiot, dump up. Uh, where I am for your ass. Hey, oh. yeah, hey, no, where I, ma'am, you still there? No. Yes, sir. You both are talking. I can't understand what you're saying. Oh, I can't hear who else is talking, Mother Jordan. Okay, yeah. Uh, well, ma'am, I am currently driving my brother's steering wheel while he okay. pushes the gas pedal on the way to your hotel. Okay. Okay, you you All want right, so, the address? Yeah. Well, I don't need the address. I need a. I, I need directions. Uh, exactly where are you now? I don't. What am I, a GPS? <laughs> we are, oh, at, we are in the, near to highway, territorial trail. Uh, beside us. Yeah, yeah, that's too much information. Let me give you back to my brother who's driving drunk. La, 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 la. <laughs> Hello, we're holding our pee outside. Huh? We're holding our pee because we can't get we can't find the toilet. Is there a toilet outside, or do we have to go inside the lobby? Do you have a toilet for us to pee? Because we're holding our pee out here. I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know who's it. I'm holding my urine, and I was hoping that you had a toilet in the lobby. Do you have a toilet lobby? The wrong number. Sorry, wrong number. No, do you have toilet lobby? Toilet lobby? I don't know. No, so wrong. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, a toilet in the lobby where you make, you know, you make the urine, you put it in the toilet, and then you flush it. Have what you ever used the toilet? What room no, I'm not here. I'm not. I don't have a room yet, but I, I need. Can I urinate in the hotel? Because we're I holding don't understand. Call me. I don't know. I don't understand. Okay. Do you know understand Ben Chode? No, no, I don't understand. Sorry about. You understand Chode? Hello. It's like the coconut fiber I, telephone lines. Hello? America's Best Value In. This is Lucy speaking. How may I help you? Hi. I'm having a little, a little trouble with my cat. He, My adventure cat. He escaped the crate that I had him in. And now he's attracted a bunch of squirrels and other wildlife from outside. Because he went outside to urinate. I kept an eye on him and all. But uh, a bunch of animals are now on him and attracted to him. You see, are you there? What room are you in? Uh, 215. You're in room 205? Yeah. Wait, um, you said 205? 215? No, what What room are you in? Right, I'm not sure. My wife had the key, and she went out to get some beer. Um... Okay. My eyeglasses what? are broke, and I can't see nothing without them. What's the name for the room? What's the name for the room? Well, it was under my wife's name. 
Okay, what's and the name? I'm I'm George. Okay. My wife. Oh. Yeah. Her name is Martha. She told me not to talk to no one on the phone because they might steal my identity. But I figure if I made the call, then you wouldn't because then I'd be calling the front desk. Oh uh, no, we won't steal. We won't steal your identity. Because I got in trouble once. My wife caught me on the phone giving away my social security number. Um. And it was because I couldn't see. I was reading not my phone number, my social security number. Where are well, you? That's a problem. You see. Where are you staying? I'm staying in the bath. The bath right now. Because I'm all dirty when I was playing with a cat outside. So I have to clean him up, and I'm in here with him. And did you, you know, he knows how to flush the toilet. <laughs> well, your cat is very skilled. Yeah. He you also likes to stare the... at me in my eyes while I make poo. Meow. <laughs> well, here's the cat right now. Meow, meow, meow. That's right, boy. Meow, Here, meow, meow, meow. 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 Do you happen to know what hotel you're staying at? Meow, meow. Did you hit zero on your phone? <laughs> Meow Well, now there's a whole bunch of cats in here. Oh, I called for backup, meow, meow. What am I supposed to do with this? Um, where are you? I'm in 1964 right now. We don't have a room 1964. You ask me when am I? I'm in 1964. I think. Okay, uh, all these cats and their urine fumes is making me all dizzy. You have the door open? Yeah, the door's wide open. I let everybody in. All the cats, the dogs, the creatures. And my son, he was on the phone with you just a minute ago. Um, no, Well, I'm calling you. Okay, um, do you know the name of the hotel you're staying at? It's called, it's called the Sylvester Arms. Sylvester on? Yes. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, I know, I know. She's not being very helpful. I'm not from Sylvester Arms. I'm in a different hotel. No. Oh. I'm getting woozy from the fumes. The cats are peeing everywhere. The ammonia is getting to me. Are you in Ark City? Do you have any litter at the front desk?
You know, these damn cats everywhere. So can you take some of the cats out? I can't hurt you. No, I'm not going to touch them. Just move them. Take some food out with you. And go outside with them. Oh. They've established a united front. They, Is anybody there? They have demand. There's, there seems to be a leader arising from the sea of cats. I think they've elected a leader. Uh, that's not exactly In... Would you like to talk to the lead cat? <laughs> no, I'm... Okay, is... is... I'm not at Sylvester Arms Hotel. I'm at America's Best Value Inn in Arc City. Oh, well, that's... Hmm. Yeah, I know. She said the cats stay free. We're going to work this out. I, I don't Ma'am, the know. Ca- the ca- think you're Ma'am, the... Ma'am, the... the... The cats are concerned that you're going to charge a daily fee for pets. I... I can't send you a daily fee because you're not staying at our hotel. She says this is not the Sylvester Arms. Hmm. The cats are processing this new information. It'll be a moment. Okay. Okay. My wife's back. Honey, honey, come over here. Do you know anything about these cats? Honey, no, not that. What's going on here? Honey, that, what, what's going on with the cats, though? She said this is not the Sylvester Arms. No, it's the best value, right? Honey. No, I said that you're not on the phone with the, it's Sylvester Arms. I said you're on the phone with the best value. Yeah, we're here at the best value, dear. What room are you in? Oh, oh we're in 215. We don't have a 215. Well, that there explains the problem then, don't it? We called the wrong hotel. Well, we got a U-Haul full of cats, and we thought we was taking them to the Sylvester Arms. Oh. Um, yeah. This is not Sylvester Arms. I'm sorry, guys. Sylvester stole my arms, and he bought himself a little lady. That's my cat's name. (laughs) <laughs> I don't know what to do. We're out of gas. We can't make it to the Sylvester Arms. One day I I met a park and the squirrel. And the park was surprised and curious about the squirrel. I asked him a lot of questions. And he didn't give me no answers. And then he looked at me and he put a top hat on. The park said, go away. Go away, you strange creature. Get out of here. And then my cat, he urinated on the squirrel. That's the end of my story. That was a great story. I know. The park <laughs> kicked me out, too. They told me you can't be talking to no squirrels or giving them no nuts. I, I pick uh, up acorns after work and okay. throw them in a bag, and I take them to the squirrels. And the cat's urine is stinking up the place. You're in a lot of trouble if she finds out they're peeing all over the place.
afternoon. Thank you for calling the Hampton at the Kansas Star Casino. This is Brandy. How may I help you? Hi, Brandy. How are you doing tonight? Good. How are you? I'm good. I'm great. I'm wonderful. I would like to know if you have room for a booking. I'm here with my <laughs> whole family. <laughs> Unfortunately, tonight we are completely sold out. Is it because of our voice? <laughs> we have a metabolic syndrome. <laughs> Yeah, tonight we're one hundred percent. Tonight we're one hundred percent sold out. Come on, don't be goofy. Ha <laughs> Sorry. I said don't be goofy, ha huh? Unfortunately we don't have any rooms available tonight. What if we told you that we have a lot of money? All right. Have a nice day. Thanks for calling. This is Mickey Mouse. Hello? Brundis, this is Kamar. How may I assist to you? Hi. We're having trouble. We we tried to get the Mickey Mouse channel on the TV, but Mickey, he's doing something awful weird here. He's got his clothes off. <laughs> <laughs> Which room? <laughs> well, we're in the bathroom, and my son's got the TV remote, and we, he locked us in here. Uh, what is your room number? Is it two one five, son? Well, he won't yes, tell us. Yes, it's two one five. <laughs> hey, is that Chuty on the phone? <laughs> Here, it's I'm gonna slip one, the two, phone five. under the door and give it to him. Here, here son. We can look Thank at you. it, okay? Give me the room number. Yeah. Possibly... No, cut that! Don't do it. The room number. GPT write a story about pants. Hilton Garden Inn, downtown front desk. My name is Taryn. How can I help you? Well, I'm sorry. Well, what's your name? My name is Taryn. I'm uh, working at the Hilton Garden Inn. How can I help you? Hi. Do you have any vacancies tonight? Unfortunately not. We are booked tonight. We are at 100%. Uh, 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 uh. Sorry about that. Oh. What's with all the goddamn 17-year-olds in this game kicking my 46-year-old ass? Like, why don't you... They need to make a, ser a server for aging Gen Xers. I think that's... Um, what do you think, sir? I don't know. I'm just an old man. I work hard. I come home. I want to play an FPS. And then there's like 17-year-olds who have been here on here all day, truant from school, honing their craft. How am I going to compete against them? I don't know how to help you with that, sir. you got to have ideas. You're probably one of these kids on here that's like shooting me. Probably. The second I pop my little head out. I always play as a medic. What do you play as? What game are you playing? Battlefield 2042. Oh, I wouldn't know then. I don't play that game. Hmm. What do you play? Do you play the, the Call of Booty? Yeah. Hmm. I had that game. I just, I don't know. I don't play it. Nice. Is there see, anything see I can... right now there's See, right now there's someone calling out to be resurrected. I'm going to run over to him, and it's a trap. Somebody's waiting to shoot me using him as bait. I understand this. So what do I do? Do I let him die or do I run into the line of fire and get killed? What do I do? Honestly, I mean, I would just let him die. You know, I, need, I needed to hear that. I needed permission to do that. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Anything else I can yeah, do? Yeah, my that? life is more important. Okay. All right. Have a good night. No, it's all. I'm just looking for tactics and video games gotcha. for people who have uh, failing eyesight and slowing reflexes. Yeah. All right. Well, have fun with all you. Right. Have a good night. All right. For calling Hyatt Regency, <laughs> Wichita. If you know your party's extension, you may dial it at any... So zero should work. Okay. Some of these are zero, and others are like maybe four and two. Oh my God. This should go to the. Mm. Okay. 
Hi, Regency Wichita. It's Brianna. Hey, Brianna. Hi, how can I help you? Hey, how are you? I'm uh, fine. How can I help uh, Yeah, I'm calling back. There's this uh, note on my car. Uh, what was your car parked at? It was at the Walmart. It says sorry on it, and then I, I couldn't tell what was wrong with the car. I started walking around it. What did you do to it? Because it just says sorry, and then this phone number. Um, I didn't do anything to your car. I'm at work, sir, so I'm not even sure. I haven't been at a Walmart. Oh, wait. I think I found what's wrong. There's a poopy in the back seat. I'm sorry? I, I, somebody poopied in the back of the car. Was, was that what you're being sorry about? No, I didn't do it, so I don't know what you're talking about. I, I can get it analyzed for DNA That's fine. evidence. Thank you for calling Wingate and Hawthorne Suites at the Wichita Airport. This is Aaron. How can I help you? Wingate. You just say Winke. Thank you for calling in to Northwest. This is Stephen. How can I help you? Hello? Hello? Hi, this is Hampton Northwest. Stephen speaking. How can I help you? Hello, Stephen speaking. Uh, I'm looking for vacancies. Do you have any? No, sir, we don't. Oh, oh, fuck it, god oh, damn it. Yeah. Oh, oh, fuck yeah. Oh, 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 oh you son of a fuck. Oh, god damn Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, give me that young cat. Mm, yeah. Oh, you dumb son. Oh, 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 the, way oh the baby. Oh, the baby. I love the way you... Thank you for calling Roadway Anna Vainsworth. This is Krista. How may I help you? Hello, oh, Roadway Anna. Krista, how you doing? Krista! Hey, hey, your name's Krista? Close enough. I thought you said your name was Krista. Okay. So how you doing? I'm all right. Thanks. Great. Okay. Uh, yeah. I was just wondering, like, what's the train traffic like down there? Is it good? Is it like, uh, is it family friendly? I'm sorry. What was that? Uh, the, the, the traffic and the train, the train traffic, is it like a family friendly or is it like a, uh, should I leave my 12 year old at home? There are no longer any trains that travel through Ainsworth. You're looking for someplace that's a bit further south than Nebraska. But yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I was, I was going, I was talking about, I want to go down south. It, There's no yeah. way. I think no, no, ma'am. I think I think you're you're talking about the exact same thing that I'm thinking about. Uh, um, it's it's uh, I I didn't I didn't plan it out at it all. And I I, I kind of need your advice. Um, uh, um, I'd be the wrong person to talk to about trains because I know nothing about them. No, I kind of doubt that because you, you sound like a slut. Yep, I am. Sure, why not? Oh, wait, no, I'm... I really yeah, are. Because the difference between a slut and a whore... All right, well, okay. Well, okay, right? Oh, oh, well, well, all right. So, you know, wonderful evening, sir. And I'll Good sorry, night. Smith. No, no, man, I'm not... No, I want to have, I want to have sex. Thank you for calling it Ainsworth in a... Or Roadway Inn of Hainsworth, this is Chris. How may I help you? Wait, you want to start that over? You you want you want to be you want to be a little more smooth with that? 
No, not particularly. Well, I don't care. Do it again. Have a wonderful evening. Good night. I command you. I'm almost done coming. Thank you for calling the Nyberra Lodge. How can I help you? Hello? Hello? Hi. Yep. Can I help you? Yeah, hi. I'm outside the grounds here, and I notice that there's a little uh, little gopher and a cat, and they're playing with each other. And there's a squirrel that came on over. He's wearing a top hat. Okay. Now, I just have a question. Is this your pet out here, the cat? No. Because he's been talking to me all night. He's been staring at me, and I've been petting him, and he's been, you know, licking me. And uh, and the squirrel, he's been talking to me, too, and he says that he works for you. No, we don't have any squirrels or cats. Well, the squirrel, he said his name was Bobby, and he likes to work on, as a maintenance man for you. Okay. Uh, do I need to come in the front and show you and I'll point them out for you? No, that's okay. All right, but I'm right here. Could you just move over to the left a little bit so you can see me through the window? Yeah, just a little bit further to the left. I see you. you look nice and pretty tonight. Last like fucking two days. Comfort in. This is Corey. Hey, Corey, that's sweet. Your parents gave you a boy's name. Oh, this stuff hits so fucking hard. Hey, um, I have a question for you, real quick, if you've got the time. Sure. Can you move to the left a little bit so I can see better? Hello? Ah. <laughs> movie recommendation. We watched a movie last night called Don't Fuck in the Woods, number two. <laughs> Hello, I was about quality in. Yes, I know, Daddy. I'm here with my family. I was driving. I need to fall and I still drive. Yes, yes. Anyhow, we need to know if we can make a real book with you. I have my son there, and I, they, can, they can help me with the booking, yes. Oh, God, yes. Oh, yes. Frozen. Linda, this is Holly. Yes, hello. Yeah, what's so, what's so quality about it? Yes. Oh, God, yes. Hello, ma'am. It's Hi. Sorry, I have my grand my grandmother. She's from yes. the uh, from the UK, the United Kingdom, and she has some questions. And I have to I have to get this answered immediately. Okay. Okay. Um, now, what is this? What is the uh, accommodations? How? What count threads are the uh, mat are the uh, sheets and the uh, the blankets? Oh, I don't know. Okay, because if they're not two hundred, at least two hundred count, then she, then she can't she can't liquefy properly. So okay. So I, we we need to figure that out before we come in, before we check in all the way. Okay. Put it all the way. Yeah. Because because at because at night she be, she becomes liquid, she becomes a puddle, and then she solidifies yeah. in the morning. And so we got to figure out how much, how much. So what? Oh God! Why am I so wet? Because if 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 there's anything below two hundred, she's gonna evaporate, and we can't have this. Oh God! Okay. Help me! Help! You're up. Roadway in. This is Cheryl. Hi, Cheryl. How are you? I'm all right. Can you tell me what channel the Punjabi network is on? The what? The Punjabi network? I don't know that network. 
The in, in Indian, it's the Indian Indian Network. No, I don't. I really don't. Oh, okay, because I just checked Punjabi TV Guide, and they said Beverly Hills Cop Punjabi Network is on. Beverly Hills Cop Punjabi. Oh, I don't know. It's, yeah, it's a really they they like to play a really distorted uh, version of the Beverly Hills Cop theme song to just uh, to just sexy women being being painted like whores with makeup, and it gets me oh. very aroused and very erect for my trips overseas. Call her back, Hey, calling Steve. Diane, this is Adam. How may I help you? Hi, this is Eve, and I'm calling for a customer survey. Uh, I'm sorry, you've reached a hotel. Yes, yes. Uh, I'm from corporate, and I'm calling to do the customer survey. Okay. I, I'd love to do a customer survey. However, I have guests here in front of me, so um, perhaps another... Oh, correct. And has, has, any, has any of them uh, checked in or have been staying at the establishment? Uh, I'm sorry. That's information I'm not comfortable giving out. Well, I'm with corporate, so it's okay. okay so I just nope, need to speak I, I to a guest, a guest, a guest that's been staying there, so I can uh, ask them a couple of five questions uh, about the performance of our staff at this establishment. Okay. Well, I'll have to place you on hold. Okay. And uh, approximately, how long would the hold be? Hello. Thanks for calling the Holiday Inn Express. How can I help you? By helping me release. I have to release. Who is this? I, want, I, I have problems releasing. I need you to help me release. Hello? Thanks for, thank, thank for calling Dan Dobrin. This is Elkin. How can I help you? Hi, we're uh, we're having a release party in the room. There is a party in the room. There's a release party. We're releasing a lot of liquids on the floor and the walls and the bedding. I work for uh, a company called Immoral Juice, and they paid me to come here and spray their juices all over the wall. But something got a little sticky here, and I I brought a couple ladies over. And they sprayed their juices all over the walls and the floor and everywhere. And it's all sticky and gooey. Uh, how can I help you? Uh, can we have some more towels? No, not at this time. I'm sorry. Oh. Uh, no, it's not at this time. It's all sticky and gooey in here. Well, uh, that's, uh, I, I don't know what you guys do in your rooms. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. Let me see if I can find some towels, but I don't think we have any. What should I do to clean up all this goo? There's milky uh, goo everywhere. I don't know, sir. I we, we have to leave it as as it is. I can find some towels, but I don't think I don't. Would think you like to any. come up here and engage in in a release party with me and my brothers? I can. I'm sorry. I have to be at the front desk. Can we come down there and have a release party in in the no. lobby? No, not in the lobby. We're not using no boom boxes or anything. We're just releasing fluids. That's, uh, that's, uh, yeah, all right. Uh, um, I, I, I don't know. Uh, how can, can I help I you? I mean, I... Can I come there and release fluids all over the floor? No, you cannot. Oh. No, 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 that's oh. not possible. We got many ladies here, and they're releasing uh, oh, God, in our room. I'm sorry, sir, but... <laughs> okay. All right. Are you releasing right. fluids uh, down there right now? <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> oh. Sound like no. you're pulling on something. No, not really. Okay, I'm going to I'm, I'm gonna oh, go really? now. On. I'm, uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to see if I can find some... What room are you in? We're in the bathroom. Well, that's where Ask you normally him. release things. Ask him about his dick. Here, oh, yeah. I need to give the phone to my brother. He want he wants to ask you a personal question. I think. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What room are you in? 
Hard. We're in the hard room. The one that's dripping with a milky substance. Okay. All right, Sam. Okay. 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 Have a good night. My grandfather used to call them. Hard. Uh, hold on, sir. My my grandfather used to call it the slop room. How, yeah. How you doing? Good. Should I call yeah, the I, campus police? Yeah. Uh, yeah it, I mean, if you if you want to. Mm, no, I mean, what should I call campus police or I, are you guys all set? No, no, no. Yeah, we're all set. I'm horny as fuck. Uh. All I want from you is that uh, maybe I come down there and we exchange moves. No. No, sir. No. <laughs> no. All right. All right. Let me know if you need anything. I may call campus police. I want to kiss. I want to kiss. I want to kiss you. Shut up. I want to kiss you. We're going to come down there. We're going to come down no. and kiss you right on All the All I want to do is fuck All right. Good mouth, guys. Man. Good All guys. Right. <laughs> I'm going to let you guys go. All right. All right. Good night. All right. Bye now. Bye. Good night. Have a good night. Hello to Milkbox right. in the chat room. Hello, everybody in Prankcast. It's a new stay at the end of a courtyard. This is Dark MLP. Hey, I'm about to prank call you, and you don't even know it yet. Are you ready? Okay. Transfer you to room 215. Uh, we don't have a 215. Okay, which one ends in 15? None. Okay, give me 110 then. 110's out of order. Okay, well, I'll take 107. We don't have a 107. Okay, what is the next one? Uh -oh. <clears throat> Do you have a purpose for calling? Yeah, prank calls. Now listen, I need 105. Might be better about taking notes. Good evening. Thank you for calling Sprinkle Sweets Moss and Andover. This is Ressa. How can we assist you? Hello? You have do you have drugs? No, I don't. No, do you know where I can get drugs at front? Listen, no, I do not. I need drugs. Yes, okay. Sir, is there anything well, else put I can me in help with? Put me in contact with someone that I can find drugs. I don't know anybody, sir. I want to do. Is there anything I need, else? Listen, okay? I need to do drugs in my room. I forgot my I forgot my Ritalin. And uh, yeah. Thank you Hello? for calling the resident sex place. Jamie speaking. How can I help you? Hi. Uh, the women are pregnant. Yeah. My brother's here with me. We're having a release party in the room. We work for a, a company. They gave us a whole case of like juices. They said, yeah, go over there and uh, release the juices in the room. And then uh, when we come back next week, you'll know exactly which room we were in, and we'll pay, you know, uh, pay you or something. I don't know. They paid us five hundred dollars to stay here, which was like, you know, it's way more than it is a, a night. So we're getting paid good, but I don't know what the deal is with the room and the juicing. But we're what getting ready to start there? releasing. It's two ten. We were getting ready. To release. I'm sorry, but we, that room number doesn't exist here. Is it 215? Because they, they gave us a key and just said, yeah, go here. Well, no, we didn't book sorry. We don't have 215 we, either. I think you might be calling the wrong location. Because we have two oh. locations in Tewksbury. Well, we started with a 2, though. I'm sorry? I think it started with a 2. Maybe you were missing a digit here? What's your last name? Well, it wasn't booked under my name. It was booked under their name. And it was just the Juice Company, Immoral Juice or something like that. I'm sorry. I think you would have to contact your, your supervisor. Oh, no. My supervisor's asleep. They sent us here two weeks ago. We only just got here because the plane broke down. And we, when we tried to you know book a, a, a bus... They denied us service because of the case of drinks that we had with us. They said, you can't bring that on here. That has, like, bad stuff in it or something in it. The ingredients. Then, uh, like, it didn't pass the FDA. So they're just, they they told us that the, you know, the, the juice is special. 
There's something special well, about it. Then you, uh, then, so what's your room number, sir? I can't help you unless you give me your room well, number. Well, that's the thing. I don't, I don't know. I, I broke my glasses today. I can't see anything. And my brother's here with me, but he's drunk, and he also crushed his glasses. So we're kind of at an impasse here because we don't know. I was doing a TikTok challenge. They said I couldn't crush my glasses up and... Hello, my name is Justin Trump. Can I help you? Hi, your phone just farted on me. <laughs> what? Yeah, what I what it picked up. It sounded like it was just a giant, like gasless uh, fart, right in my ear. <laughs> I'm sorry. I hope that doesn't happen every time I answer the phone. Was it you? No, no, I promise. You sure? I'm very sure. <laughs> well, that's good. <laughs> um, my brother's here. Let me let me put him on the phone here, cause he was gonna make like yeah all this. I gotta drive. Yeah, sorry. Uh, I'm not your brother. I'm your. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you guys book in a room. <laughs> oh, he, my brother is. He dropped his phone in the toilet. Right uh, hello. You take hello. That. <laughs> give me, give, give me the phone. Hello, ma'am. Mhm. Hello. I ate my glasses. Sounds like a rough time. I, I ate my glass. No, I just said TikTok. My waver, my Waverly glasses I ordered on the internet. They said they were made of lemons and recycled peels, and I ate them. <sighs> Did they say to that word? <laughs> they tell what now? I said, did they stay true to their word? Did it actually? I, it tasted waxy to me. But uh, I, I, they said that I had to crack the lenses and put them into a dip, like a ranch dip, and eat them like potato chips. And oh. and and now my and now my insides taste all cutty. <laughs> that sounds like a rough night. Yeah, and I think I need to drink more alcohol because it'll disinfect the insides of myself. <laughs> Maybe. You know how you know you know how like alcohol when you get a cut and then it, it stinks. Yeah, yeah, like you could probably do it the same way. Yeah, it's like when you put it on your knee when you got a cut. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah, I mean, whatever works, right? <laughs> uh, Thank you calling Chateau Merrimack. Joe Vaughn speaking. Hi, hi, how are you? I'm good. How are you doing? I'm good. Listen, compl- I have a complaint about my room if you have the time. How can I help you, sir? Well, the the ventilation. I, I'm in my room, and I have the easel up, and I'm I'm creating art in my room. But the ventilation seems to be lackluster. A lot of fumes are just stagnant in this room. Can you explain, sir? Well, I have the easel up, and I, I, I work, I'm a, um, it's not graffiti, but I, they call me a street artist. But I'm in here, and I'm doing, I'm doing the painting on the easel, and on the, on, it's like when I spray it, and then just, it doesn't suck the fumes out. It's just a lot of fumes in here. I'm truly I'm I, I'm not sure, sir. Um, is there any? And I get people. I get yeah. Huh? What's that? Is there any possible way you can crack the window? I know it's a little cold, but I, I'm not 100 percent sure why it's not doing anything. Well, yeah. I mean, I opened the window, but the amount of spray paint that I'm spraying in here is it's an abundant amount. And the people next door, they come. They're just they come over and they're knocking on my door. They're asking me to cut it out. Uh, I told him I would cut it out, but that, I mean, between me and you, it's a lie. It's, it's a damnable lie. And so I started spraying some more, and then I got some on the walls. But we need to turn the ventilation up because we, Wait, a lot got, of this you got paint, you got paint, You got paint on the walls, sir? Yeah, well, I, I screwed the easel, you know, the, uh, the mat, the little painting, the little painting mat. I screwed Wait, it to the screwed, wall. You screwed it inside the wall, so you made holes in the wall? No, no, I screwed it into the wall, but there's no easel. They're like, I don't have an easel to hold it up, and I can't That's paint what I'm just, you know, holding it. One. Yeah, yeah, I screwed it into the wall. And what room are you in? 
I'm in two, I'm in two fifteen, and so I put I put four screws, one in each corner, so that I could have a stable paint. And so I'm painting it, and then it started dripping because I put too much too much of the spray paint on there, and then I got some on the walls. All right, sir. Just give me one moment. And and I've I've and you don't have to worry about the cleanup. I have paint thinner. And I'll be more than willing to put a liberal splash of it on the walls after I'm done, after I unscrew it and everything. But you have to tell the neighbor people, the people in the rooms next to me, the one over at 213 is the one that's causing the most ruckus. You tell him to, like, just, just calm it down. I'm an artist, goddammit. This is how I make my, this is how you guys are going to get paid. And what's your name, sir? My name is Dwight. Uh, but I go, I go by different, I go by different names because I want people to appreciate my art. Um, I understand. I'm kind of like the band of, the... My, of my of my generation. I completely understand that, sir. And what's the room name? What's the room? The name under the room? Uh, what I don't know what credit card I gave you guys. I I found. No, a I'm talking about the, the name. The re- I'm talking about the reservation, I don't know. sir. Yeah, yeah. Whatever would have been on the card. I I have mo- I have multiple cards that I've found and I book rooms under. So whatever was on that card is the is the name I would have used. Seriously? Let me find this. Let me find this card. Hang on. I think I used I think I used the green one. Uh, um, the la- the last name is Johnson. First name is Kevin on this one. Okay, sir. So I can't do anything about that right now, but I do have to. You let can't you know that you, I, you can't. You can't turn the ventilation up to, to suck some of these fumes out of here. No, suck. I can't, sir. And I and I can't. Um, I do need to find out what room you're in because the simple fact is that from your name, you said your name was Dwight, but we yeah. don't have a Dwight under the house. So what you said you're in two fifteen. Two fifteen is somebody mm-hmm. on the first. Are you on the first or second floor? Fuck it. Well, two, two, two would indicate the the, the second floor. What are you talking about? That's what I'm trying to confirm. What what is the name on your room? I I, I don't know. I told you before. I use credit. I use credit cards. People no, pay me in different ways. On the key, on the key, on the key, it shows a number and a name. Two fifteen. But it shows a name. What do you mean a name? So none of the keys legitimately say 215. It's either two digits or a name. What is the name? I have a I have a card. I'm talking about the key, sir. Yeah, I'm a, you had the card in the sleeve, right? Like the card no, for the room. Sir, the key that you opened the door with. Yeah, but you're saying cuz you put it in a title inside of a sleeve. Right. I'm so sorry, sir. Are you calling the there. right hotel? Yes. What's the name of this hotel? Listen, listen. We we got to get this squared away because if we don't get this and squared I'm away, you, and then sir, I'm just I'm, I'm just going back to painting. Is is what's going to happen? Sir, what is the name of the hotel you are staying at? The, the one right now, or the one I'm going to tomorrow? No, the one you're just staying at tonight. Oh, oh, I I don't know. Who's in my room? Who's here? Who's that? Uh. All, right, this, all I know is, is I'm in the room and there's a squirrel man in here. Hey, I'm a squirrel. <clears throat> I'm I'm secret squirrel. I'm, I'm painting I'm sorry, him. Sir. I'm painting him. I'm painting him with the rollers, and I'm having him run into the wall and put prints on the wall. Do you want me to do a downward spiral? Let, hey, painting? listen. Let's start fucking and sucking, squirrel man. Come on. Oh, yes. Don't give me that dick, squirrel man. Yeah, give me that dick, squirrel man. Uh, 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 put the speaker phone in my ass. Yeah. Oh, the speaker phone's in my ass. Damn it, that feels so good. Uh, 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 damn you. Uh, 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 uh. There. Uh, why? Why? Can you please tell me what room you're in? And can you please tell me what I tell you? 215. 
215. What is all right? He's what is the name under the reservation? He's fucking my ass right now. He's a squir- squirrel man. What what was your name? I think we used your card. Oh, my name is Big Dick. Can you check under right, squirrel right. man? All right, squirrel sir. At this moment, I'm gonna end up calling the police because this is um you're saying that you're performing a criminal act. So I am Shut going up. to call. Are you? Are you are you gonna tell them about Squirrel Man? I'm going Please to trace don't. his phone number and have them come over. No, 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 no! Because Squirrel, this would be Squirrel Man's third strike, and they'll have to put him down. They told me I couldn't pack, come back out of the trees. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh six, National North. This is Ryan speaking. Hi, hello. Um. Can you guys tell the people in the room next door to me to quiet down, please? Oh, you. Uh, what is your room number? Uh, oh, yeah. Can you hear them? Uh, oh. <laughs> you fucked up, man. All right. Front double to your airski. I'm going to help you. Can you guys please keep it down in the room next door, please? I'm sorry? Oh, beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. I think hey, thank you for quality in this time. How can I help you? Oh, hello. Hi. Hi. Can you explain why the men next door are making loud noises? Oh, uh, can I know what's the room number? Well, their number is like 214, and mine's the one next door to it. I think. Okay. My eyes aren't so good. But do you hear that? They've been doing it like like rabbits all day and all night. Oh, I'm coming. I'll, I'll check it out. Oh, wow, you're Sorry, coming? But That's kind yeah. of cool. Thank you. Southburn, Tennessee. Hello. <coughs> Do what? Hello, uh, this is Front Desk. Yeah, uh, yes. Uh, so, are you able to hear any noises right now? I'll take 200 for it. It's. Is it quiet now? It's dang good when it's 5,000 watts. I'm sorry. Cinnamon Save America, how can I help you? Hi, do you have cinnamon? I'm sorry? Do you have cinnamon, the spice? We do not have cinnamon. Uh, do you know where I can get cinnamon? Um, at... This time, not anywhere that I can think of, but like in the morning, probably Shaw's. Oh, that's okay. Because I can't climax without cinnamon, and my wife is disturbed. Okay. So I need I need cinnamon, or it's just gonna wreck my marriage. I'm sorry, I don't have cinnamon. I'm gonna come downstairs and give you ten dollars. You need to run and get me cinnamon, please. That's less than executive court. Hi. Um, I'm an executive, and I'm very important, and I would like to come down from my room and to the front desk and insult you to your face and make you feel inferior, and then you will just smile at me as I walk away. Okay. Can't wait. Uh, well, I would like to do that, and I would also like to throw salt in your face. Okay, whatever. Have a good day. Hey, listen... Good evening. Thank you for calling Spring Hill Suites in Manchester. Uh, this is Ryan Russell speaking. It, it hurts. Yeah, but okay. he, listen, just ease it. Just ease it. Ease the rectum. It'll all it go hurts. in. It'll be fine. Yeah, it's okay. Let me put a little salt Her down here, honey. There. He went in. Yeah. I'm going to pour some salt. I'm going to pour some salt in there. You know how the meat and all the moisture she can just miss Thank tonight. you for calling Spring Hill in Manchester. This is Ernesto speaking. How may I help you? Ernesto? Yeah, this is he. How can I help you? Yeah, hi, this is Alejandro. 
How can I help you? I, I'm treating this man like a piece of meat. I'm putting a nice salt rub on him, and I'm rubbing it all over to bring the moisture out before I tenderize him, and then apply the heat. Police calling about. Oh, hello? Courtyard Marriott, this is Therese speaking. How may I help you? Hi. There's a bear, like a stuffed animal, outside my door. And uh-huh. a lady, she dropped it. And I'm not sure if she, like, works here. She had hair on her head. Um, she had um, clothes on. Mm-hmm. And she said she worked here. Was that you? Um, it wasn't me. Oh. How do I get in contact with the lady that has the, you know, owns the bear so I can bring it back to her? I'm not sure. Oh. My brother's here. He's working on his bicycle. And my other brother's here and he's, he's got the pixie sticks and he's been eating them all night. And I think we're going to have a trouble with his tummy later. Listen, the bike's almost ready. Like, did you get permission to ride it in the hallway yet? This thing's almost done. Can I ride my bike in the hallways? Was there anything else that you needed, sir? Yeah, I need to know. Is it safe to ride the bike? Like, through the hallways? Oh, what Ask room were you stairs. in? Oh, well, I don't think that matters. It's not pertaining to the room. He's busy inspecting the bicycle, that mattress, no rubbing the bicycle's tires. Yeah, he listen, uh, who is this ignorant fuck that just interrupted you? Hey, who, state your name and your occupation, motherfucker. Hi, uh, yeah, I'm working on the bicycle. Everybody go into general chat. Genital chat? Yeah, into toilet, toilet roasting. And everybody uh, do a okay. catastrophe. Okay. Everybody. Good evening, and thank you for calling the True by Hilton, downtown Manchester. This is Matthew speaking. How may I assist you? Oh, uh, well, don't you have a slut's name? Okay, I will now be ending this call. You have a nice night. Thank you for calling the Fairfield Hooks. This is Brittany. How can I help you? Hey, Brittany. Um, how do you turn the ventilation system up in this room? Uh, the thermostat's on the wall. On the wall, will turn it up or down. Yeah, yeah, but I need the suction. I need, like, the uh, the air inside of the room to go out. Uh, like, I don't want the fan to blow to blow in, to blow in, like, cold air or nothing. I need the, the what I have in here to go out. You can turn it off, but we don't, you can't, like, blow it outside. Okay, because the the spray paint fumes is it's like there's like a cloud in here, and it's I'm like I it's making it difficult to see, and my respirator is not cutting it. Where, I'm I'm sorry, did you call the right place? Yeah, but I'm in my room. Uh, I'm I'm an I'm an artist, and I've been trying to create some different works of art because I'm this is how I support myself. I actually went to um I went to college and got a degree in what they call street art. It's actually a liberal arts degree. But the the problem is, is the people want it live streamed and I don't have internet at home, so they want a, a live stream of me creating. So I've got the live stream going with the internet and I'm spray painting in the room on the on the on the whole thing, on the platforms. Yeah, and well, just a lot of a lot of I'm a two fifteen. And so I'm I'm having a problem because it's very hard it's very hard to work if I can't see the I if I can't see the uh, oh the pla- the way I'm I'm painting on. Well, if you're painting in one of our rooms, then you're going to be charged. You're going to be you're you're going to be charged a damage deposit. Well, but can't I can't see. I can't, but I, well, I can't I can't see the canvas. I'm trying to spray paint it, and like the black and gray, it's it's crazy thick. The viscosity of the spray paint is crazy. And I do want to let you know I got some on the walls uh, because I had to because I don't have my easel in here and I had to screw the canvas to the wall. Good evening. Thank you for calling the Holiday in Manchester Airport. This is Cheyenne speaking. How can I help you? Hey, um, I'm having an issue. Uh, what? How do you reverse the fans in the room like to an exhaust instead of a fan blowing in? I need to have the fumes sucked out. Sorry, could you repeat that? 
Yeah, I'm trying to reverse the, you know how the fans, we have the fan adjustment in here where you can adjust it one, two, three, and it'll, it'll, it'll blow harder. Like if you go up higher in the numbers in the room. Yeah. Yeah. I need to reverse it. I need to suck it out instead of push it in. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if the fans can do that. Yeah. Uh, well, I, I need, I need, I need to dissipate this, this, uh, spray paint cloud. Like I, you know how spray paint, where you use spray paint, it produces like a cloud, like, cause it's a mist, right? So it makes like a cloud, but I'm in here trying to create like just fantastic art and it's really hindering my ability to see what I put on the canvas so far. Yes, this piss. is comfort. How can I help you? Hi, is this piss? No, sir. Piss town? This is, this is comfort, and sir. Oh, can I lay down in the bed and piss in the bed? Uh, what is it, sir? Are you okay? You sound like you're asleep. Uh, did I wake you up? Uh, 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 I mean, are are you in the hotel or? Yeah, are you sleeping on the job or what's going on? You're, are you okay? You sound. Well, what heavy. is what is your room number? What oh, it's the room? one where the heavy man sleeps. What is your room number, sir? I'm the heavy man. I don't remember. I just know I'm the heavy man. I'm the heavy. Oh, who's the heavy man? I'm the heavy man. Oh, I'm also man. the heat wave man sometimes. I'm oh. also the immoral juice man sometimes too. Oh. Yeah, I do immoral things with juice. Does this guy know what futk means? Futk? I don't know. Oh. What was that? Who's on the line? I thought I called the hotel. Hi, I, I'm uh, I'm the manager here at the front desk. This is my man, my man at the desk. Oh, I saw some old videos of me, and I was like, oh my god, look how fat my fucking face is. Hello, good evening, Econo Lancho. Can I help? Shut up. Hello. Shut shut the fuck up. I'm trying to gather my thoughts. Shut, just shut the fuck up for a second. Sir, so you're not going to talk to me like that, okay? Listen, listen okay. shut the fuck shut up. The fu- Damn it. Oh, 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 oh. I'll do it here. Oh, oh. Hello, good evening, Econolodge. How can I help? Hi, how are you doing tonight? I'm good. Okay. So I'm here with my brother and... Uh, we're wondering if you have any vacancies. That's number one. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. We do not have any vacancy at this time. Ah, uh, shut the fuck up. Thank you for calling downtown Manchester's Double Tree by Hilton. This is John. Oh, How may I direct oh, your call? Oh, oh, John, shut the fuck up. Thank you for calling True by Hilton Concord. Zach speaking. How can I help you? Hey, Hello? Zach. Hi. Hey. Shut the fuck up. Hello? Hello? Shut hi. the fuck up. Hi. I'm sorry. Hello? Yeah, hi. Can you hear me? Good evening. You've reached the residence in by Marriott in Concord, New Hampshire. This is Matt speaking. How may I help you? You sound drunk, Matt. What's going on? (laughs) No, no, just relaxed. Okay, so you're on, are you on uppers, downers? No, nothing fun. (laughs) Did you you take the the blue pill or the red pill? Uh, did both. (laughs) Okay, listen. I've got a I've got a plug inside of me, and I need somebody to come help get it out. H- Hello. Yeah, I'm still here. The plug is inside. Hmm. Well, nothing I can help. Someone's, so, somebody's treating me like a dirty sink, and they put the plug in. 
to keep the water from going down. A Fielding in Concord, New Hampshire. This is Zach speaking. How can I help you? Zach? Hi. Yeah. Did you know Lawrence, Lawrence Fishburn has a cockeye? I did not. Okay. Well, now you know. Now, can you help me with my room situation? Uh, sure. Uh, um, I didn't know you guys, you know, you know the sink in the room? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't know it didn't have a garbage disposal, and now I have a huge problem in here. You didn't know your hotel sink didn't have a garbage disposal? Yeah, I figured, because I'm I'm from overseas, and I, from everything I've heard, like all my friends, my friends on Discord... Um, and on like YouTube chats and stuff, they always said like all American sinks have have the garbage disposal. So I just started cramming a bunch of stuff down, and now the pipe is spilling the release like all over the place. Like I like I'm trying to run the water down because they say you gotta have water for the garbage disposal or to get bound up. And now like just 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 water everywhere. There's stuff. There's goo. I, there's goo. I poured I poured a bunch of stuff down here, and I gotta have a problem. Okay, well, your information you got was incorrect. I'd say most American sinks do not have garbage disposals. What room oh. are you in? Because I got, uh, do you know this, The they call it the Colonel, the Kentucky, uh, Kentucky. Um, well, what room are you they in, They do sir? chicken. They do chicken, and there's bones, and I was disposing of the bones, and I put it down there. What room are you in? Uh, I'm in the one one zero one. One teen? One teen? Which room? One teen? One, 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 zero, one teen? One ten? Yeah. And what's your name? Hey, Steve. Okay. Steve. Yeah, what, what, yeah, what's going on, Bill? Um, have you unplugged the drain yet? I have to get rid of this motor oil because I'm doing an oil change I'd in the parking lot. I put the cur the colonel's best crispy, super crispy chicken bones in the in the sink. Yeah, when you get that cleared out, hurry, tell me so I can put, put the motor oil down. Put, put the oil in. I bet it'll help it go down. All right. Yeah. I'll, okay. I've got like a gallon jug of old motor oil now. I'll put it in. All right, guys. Okay. As funny as this is, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Is there anything else I can help you with? How are you? Yeah. Who is your daddy, and and what does he do? Yeah, who is my daddy, daddy and what does he do? All righty. Well, that's all I can help yeah. you with today. Did, did he teach you the life lesson of boys have a penis and girls have a vagina? Because that's very important. He mm -hmm. did. He sure did. Okay, don't let, those li didn't. don't let those liberals teach you anything different, all right? Just let me know. All righty, man. Sounds good. Yeah. You guys have a good night. All right. Are right, you got any liberals staying there? We can call and educate right, them you. too. Transfers to a room. <laughs> so so they were okay, super great. This is there. Taylor. How can I help you? Hey, um, I want to let you know that your name is the name of a horse. I'm sorry? Yeah, your name is the name of a horse. And listen, you don't put a condom on a horse because a horse will plow you, of course. Sir, is there something I can do for you? Yeah, I need a condom. I can't help you with that. I need to put it on you, you horse. Have a good night. Horse. I'm making a motel. Uh, I'm here. I'm here with Drew Carey, and he's got his foot stuck in the safety hole out here. I got my foot stuck. Where are you? We're in the hallway area. He's got his foot yeah. stuck in the safety hole. Hold a second. Are you in the yeah, back? My... In the front. In the front? Oh, okay. Hold a second. I'm coming out there. Hold on. Are Which room are you supposed to be in? Well, no, Hold we're on. just visiting. What do you mean you're supposed to be? We've been with ladies all night. They, they, re, they st resist here. Maybe we're around Wait, back. What's I'm happening? not sure, because... Are you going through the junk drawer or something? What's happening? It might be in the back. We're all turning yeah, around because the safety hole's got his foot real tight. Oh, go fuck yourself, okay? Sorry? <laughs>
Thank you for calling Motel 6 Santa Rosa. Can you please hold? Uh, yes. Uh, All right, thank you. Uh, 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 Hi, thank you for calling Best Western. How may I help you? Hi, I'm here. I'm here, and the safety hole's got my foot. Sorry? Uh, I got here earlier, and the safety hole in the hallway area has got my foot. Can you so, help are you me here? With the safety. Yeah, I'm here, and there's a, there's a hole. It says safety hole on it. My foot got stuck in there. I can't remove my shoe. My foot's trapped in the safety hole. What's the room number? Oh, I don't have a room number. I'm visiting some ladies. They prefer that I not give anything out, you know. Okay, hold on. Safety hole. And I think it's not, uh, he's not here. The what? Hello? Hi. How can I help you? Yeah, I'm out here in the hallway. And my foot's in the safety hole. What? My foot's in the safety hole. What can I do about that? Well, I, I, can you come here and maybe give me a hand? Mm. No, I cannot come. This is hotel. I cannot leave the desk. Oh, what about the other person I was talking to? No. Call 911. Come. Your sister said that you can. Kuti. Haram Jabi Kuti. Stop calling the wrong numbers. Oh. Thank you for calling Hampton Inn Suite. I have a quick call. How can I help you? Hey. Hey, nope. hey, 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 hey. Yeah, listen, nope. the cat ain't gonna fuck itself, all right? Listen, nope. it's in the walls. It's stuck. Uh, don't act like you. Thank you for calling the Airport. This is Joshua. Ooh, my name is Joshua. Ooh, I'm very important at the front desk. Ooh. <laughs> Best question, Airport Albuquerque. This is Jasmine. How can I help you? Hello. Albuquerque. That's what you're airport, airport Albuquerque. This is Jasmine. How can I help you? Hello. How can I help you? Hi, I think I caught a foot fungus from your shower pan in my room. Oh, yeah? What room are you in? 215. What was that? Two fifteen. Two fifteen. Yes. What? What's your name? Bob. So yeah, I, yeah, I went to sleep. On the same wavelength yeah. here. Oh. Thank you for calling. All right. If... Hello. Grandpa, I have to. Grandpa, I have to put it in there. That's where the doctor said it goes. Please don't. It hurts. It's a suppository. It goes in your bum. All right. Be gentle, please. All right. Uh, ready for it. Good morning. Thank you for calling Extended Stay America, Albuquerque Airport. This is Douglas. How can I help you? Can you just please tell them to quiet down? They're in the room next door. Um, what room number, sir? Can you hear them? Sir, what room number? Hold hold on, I'm going to put the phone on the wall. So sir, you can hear them. sir, I need to know oh, what room number. Oh, 
Good evening. Thank you for calling Extended Stay America, Albuquerque Airport. Yeah. Douglas, how can I help you? Yeah, hi, Douglas. Me and Sebastian are in our room, and there's some old man in the room next to us, and he's yelling, asking us to keep it down. He's banging on the walls. Keep it fucking down in there! Can you hear uh, Room number, please quit calling. Uh, can you, you hear him? Fucking you gay, hear him? motherfucker! Twenty nine dollars. I'm like, oh, it's not a bad price. It's like fifty eight, fifty two shipping. Hey, okay. would you buy a bag of chips, like a twelve twelve bag of chips, twenty nine dollars on Amazon, but they want sixty dollars shipping? Does this sound like a good deal? You're asking me. I don't. Yeah. I don't think. That, yeah, I don't think that's a good deal for shipping. Sixty dollars. Okay. What? Yeah, yeah, but it's a twenty nine dollar price point for the for the twelve bags of chips. Like full size bags? No, no, they're snack bags. They're they're uh, mm. they're protein chips. They're keto protein mm-hmm. chips by Quest. They're twenty nine dollars for a twelve pack of snack bags, and then fifty eight fifty two shipping. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't. You wouldn't. Is, no. is it the shipping that's throwing you that's throwing you yeah, off the a bit? Shipping. Yeah, the shipping. Yeah. Okay, well, I'll I'll skip those. All right, all right. Let's continue shopping then. Um. What do you feel about the Hilo, the Hilo bags, the Hilo protein chips? I don't know what those are. Well, they're the same thing, but they're a different brand. Same price as well as shipping? Well, no, 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 not not, not the same price. Like, if I were to get a 12 count of the Hilos, uh for 12 pack of basically three flavors, 12 pack, I can get those for twenty one ninety nine free shipping. That's not bad. And, and the and the it, yeah, they come with the salt, the spicy salsa, the ranch, basically the blue bag, which is the Doritos knockoff, and then the regular, which is the red, like the red bag knockoff. Uh, twenty one ninety nine, <clears throat> free free shipping, but I gotta suck someone's dick. Hmm. Yeah, just suck my it. dick. You what for some for some chips? You wait, wait a minute. How old is you? I'm t- I'm, I'm not asking you for you. You're you, gonna do it. What? Where, and wait a minute, where'd you grow up? I'll suck your dick for some chips. Where'd you grow up? Mm-mm. No, no, where'd you grow up? Like, like no, reg- regional-wise. Um, Tatuka? Where the fuck is that? Hey, she says she... The spicy mm. salsa is pretty good. Kind of large. Uh, this is Bobby. Can I help you? Shut the fuck up, hey. Bobby. You interrupted me and shit. Yeah, damn you, motherfucker. Yeah, I said shut the fuck up, Bobby. My father is up here. He's a fucking diabetic and he's got the he's got the dementias and you're making a little <laughs> <laughs> you tell me to go fuck myself. Good evening, Robin. Can I help you? Hi, I'm outside here with my son in law and his brother and his sister's wife, brother, son. And we're in the station wagon out here. We weren't sure where to park because there's a cat is roaming around and he's got what looks like a squirrel attached to him or something. Maybe oh, a different ho- animal entirely. I'm sorry, where, what hotel are you at? I think you're calling a oh, wrong this hotel. One. I'm at your hotel. Okay. We're in downtown. Well, come here. out here. Just come out here and see, god damn it. You queer bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Your fingers are gonna break. So, so you lied. You knew it. That's why you're and shitting me. Sweet. Good. We can tell them about the fingers breaking off in people's asses. Thank you for calling the Embassy Suites front desk. My name is Joshua. How can I help you? Hi, Joshua. I can't talk to you anymore. Josh. Uh, yes. What's the country in Africa that starts with a K? Have a good night. How's that bad? What what country is it? Does no, anybody know? I, no, I'm just saying I'm tired. So I'm just I'm really tired now. Oh, this one has a funny number. Not really. All right, I got an idea. On the home two suites by Hilton. This is Stephen. How may I assist you? Steven, we're up here in the room and we're we're playing a game and I and I have a I have a celebrity call. I get to call somebody to help me answer the question. 
Can you help me, Stephen? Sure. What country? What country in Africa starts with a K? Mm. I'm not sure about that one. You can Google it. Do you have Google? I can't. Oh, sure. I I can't do it. It's, it's got to be you the one to answer the question. Do you ask him to move a little bit to the left so I can see him a little bit better? Yeah. Can you? Can you suck on these nuts? <laughs> You're funny. Ramada Plaza Midtown. Yeah, I got a goddamn squirrel in my room. A squirrel in your room? This goddamn squirrel, it's like smart or something. It can take the, the, the electrical outlet off and put it on, and it goes in the wall and hides. Okay. It's right here with my boyfriend. He was licking his sack, his little nut sack. It wants his nuts. Talk to my okay. boyfriend. Okay. How about that? Get a life. Hi. Hi, hi, my oh, hi I'm the oh. boyfriend. I'm the boyfriend. Get the fuck up. Back the fuck up, bitch. I'm the boyfriend. Hey, I'm double parked here. Get a life. I'm a double par- I'm a double park in your fucking asshole. Oh, but Jesus Christ. Listen to this hussy on the phone. She sounds like such a bitch. You sound oh. like a dumbass, and your mom should have swallowed you. I'm gay, and that's <laughs> a hate crime for you to say that. I don't give I'm a shit. You're in my you. hotel and talking shit. I'm You're an egg. YouTube's AI system accused me of hate. It's really speech. broken. Kirky Hotel. This is my Can I help you? Hi. Yeah, hi. I, dro- I dropped it. Oh. Like How are you? <laughs> yeah, that's the problem. Is I, well, no, no, I'm fine, but. But I dry. Listen, I I work for the the university. Yeah. Uh-huh. You you know we have the room. we have the room right. Okay. Um, I I accidentally dropped the 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 super termites that I had that I was transporting back to the university. I dropped it in the in the in, in the, in the, beaker, the, the, <laughs> the beaker broke. I did it now. Yeah. That sounds yes. horrible. Yeah, my, see, my concern is they'll turn this. They'll turn. I was gonna call the hospital. This hotel into <laughs> toothpicks by the morning. I fucked it up. God damn it! If you want us to protect me, you, you, you believe me though, Who right? Is like, this? My, my name is Dwight, and I, I'm a I'm a phone criminal, and I apologize. <laughs> I, I fucked fuck that. Up. Yeah, I'm his phone criminal PO officer. Yeah, I used to be I used to be a sex pervert from America, but then I reformed and became a phone, a phone criminal. And, uh, <laughs> and I'm his boyfriend. Damn it. Yeah, he went to the he work study him. program in jail to learn uh-huh. how to make prank calls. Oh, I'm his boyfriend okay. and I got a big one. Well, maybe maybe you can practice and when you call the Motel 6 or you call the La Quinta or something, no, you right. can you'll get it down. Yeah, Hold on. What, what was your name? What was your name? My mom would be mad. This is Jessica. What was your name? Because they told us to call you. They said call her over there, the and they was talking all this shit. Who is they? What? What's, what's your name? Hold on. What's your name? I just told you my name. You're not listening. No, you didn't. Yeah, you stupid fuck. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Front desk. <laughs> Front dick. Thank you for calling Best Western Plus Executive Suite. This is Christine. Stupid. Stupid. Uh, Sorry, I'm I'm an executive with a major corporation. Okay. And uh, is that place suitable for a conference? Um. Yes, it is. Okay. How big is your venue? Um, it depends how you want it set up. Um, there's hmm. different ways to set it up. If you want like the circle tables or the rectangle tables, 
you want it set up like classroom style or like dining style or this depends. But, I mean, it's a pretty nice size room, though. Yeah, we're going to have lots of interesting sessions. Like, one of them is All Non-Gingers Must Die. It's going to be led by Cartman. Okay. And yeah, uh, Don't forget yeah. our special guest, uh, Michelle Clevenger. She's going to come in and she's going to do a panel. Yeah. Okay. And uh, also and Martha Stewart's going to gonna come in. Uh, I doubt that. Yeah, Martha, but. Uh, next week, yeah, Martha, Martha Stewart's going to do a panel on investing, more like insider trading. She's going to jerk off Snoop Dogg, too. Actually, do you think this place has continental breakfast? Front desk. Ask about it. Yeah, yeah. It's not like an old man. Thank you for calling Spring Hill Seats, Albuquerque North. This is Adriana. How can I help you? Hey, do you guys have the uh, continental breakfast downstairs in the morning? Oh, it's my It's complimentary, God. yes. Uh-huh. From 7 to 10. Yeah, yeah. Um, uh, do you know what's included in the breakfast? Like what, what foods are available? Usually scrambled eggs. Bacon, sausage, there's an um, assortment of muffins, croissants, bagels, English muffin, and then is there's it, fruit. Is there, like pan- pan- is there any like pancakes, waffles? Waffles like are on the weekend, so this weekend there'll be waffles, yes. It's Saturday, Sunday is waffle day. Okay. Kind of, kind of a make it, make yourself waffle, like a yes, station? Yes, correct. Uh-huh. Yes. Correct. Okay. The, um, when they, they use the batter. I'm not sure. Do you guys use regular batter, like a Bisquick, or is it just a generic batter? Uh, I can go back and find out. Hold on one second, okay? No, no, you, you don't. Like, uh, you don't it's I don't a know batter that. Uh, yeah, it's a batter. That, it's a premix batter. They, basically, they mix it together. A pre-mix. Yeah. Okay. Um, I, I'm I'm currently on a keto diet. Uh, actually, it's been two years now, and I'm down uh, about 141 pounds. And I was just wondering, are they able to like any cardboard boxes that they have back there? Can they chop that up into a fine powder so that I can make some waffles in the morning? Chop what up into a batter? The mix itself? No, no, the the cardboard boxes that the that the mix came in. Oh, the cardboard box. Uh, yeah, I can see if yeah, there's an empty box what, back there. Yeah, because that's essentially what. Uh, all keto flour, like almond flour, is made out of. It's just chopped up cardboard box, and I would like to heat that up and eat it. Okay, I'll let them know. Okay, it's, it's the only way because what it does is the the fibers from the box they actually uh, expand inside of my stomach when I apply ample amount of uh, of sugar water, which is just orange juice. It expands and it keeps me from being hungry. It, I don't know if they're going to be able to turn into a powder though. Yeah, the cardboard well, box. They'll just chop it up very, 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 very fine, like if they were cutting up an onion or something. But it but it makes my poop slide out like it basically it cultivates my uh, my digestive tract and all the poop slides out. But it, it comes out real nice. It comes out real fine. Uh, it's kind of okay. like a wax we'll, and play We'll out. see what play we can do. It. Okay. Okay. For you. Right. I love you. I love you. I love Bye. Extend in the America. How can I help you? Uh, I, uh, the man here, he, he kind of, he took my pillow. Uh, he's the man next door and he came in my room and he took my pillow. What room do you have? Uh, 215 in the man, he come in, he, he tell me his name is Dwight. He said, give me the pillow and I say, I don't know. And he took my pillow, man. What room do you have? Talk. He's, 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 do you hear you him? Have? Listen. Okay, let me have your room number. Oh, yeah. Let me have two, your room number. Two. 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 Uh, I see. Yeah. Let me have your room number. Uh, a two, a two, uh, three. Uh, Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. I barely bueno, can hear you. Bueno. Le- 
buenas tardes. Uh, soy, me llamo Pilo y ya están. No tengo nomás. Uh, the guy he took in the pillows. ¿Cuál persona le quitó sus almohadas? Nuestros ¿Qué? pequeños hermanos. ¿Dónde está el sanitario? He took in the pillow, man. Does it come with fries? <laughs> nice. No.